done this year and I'm so happy and proud of them and it's just amazing because our team hasn't come in this high in a long time and um, I'm proud to say that I was part of this team when we did very pleased with it. Um, I'm very proud of myself and I have to say that a lot of it came down to my team and I wouldn't have done it if I didn't have them here cheering me on and cheering me on doing practice and doing everything they can in order to support me. Mia has been a great factor on the team this year. She's been a leader uh, in practice. Uh, she's a motivator. She helps the kids improve. She works with them. Uh, she's, you know, she's, she's the kind of person you want to have on your team. She like works with everybody, makes every, you know, and they and and they respond to that. Because they respond to that kind of uh, participation. Um, I'm really pleased with my change I am. My best time previous from that was a 205. And to be able to come here and do that today, I was not expecting that. And I couldn't be happier. I knew that I needed to drop time, and I didn't know where I was going to drop it within it. But overall, the way I swam it, I dropped time in every single 50. And it was a great swim. I was, I was pretty happy with my 100 fly. I went the same time today as I did at FCAC Finals. And it was a great time. But um, I was looking for a little more, but that's okay. I'm going to come back strong at Opens, and I have uh, further, like, future plans ahead of that, or uh, later than that, um, for Nationals in three weeks, and I'm just, I'm excited for the next two meets.